Hey, what's going on YouTube? UA Reviews here, and today we got a review video on the Under Armour Big Timing basketball shorts. All right, so I've had these for a little while, and uh, you know I always like to do basketball short reviews. Um, you know I do a lot of short reviews in general on a lot of Under Armour's athletic uh, short apparel, but uh, this was something that I wanted to review. I hadn't done any basketball shorts in a while. I think the last ones I did was the Easy Money shorts, so this was something that came out. I believe late 2013, and they've come out with more colors in 2014. Um, you know, you might be able to correct me on that, but this was something that I, you know, wanted to review. This was a lot of the basketball shorts here recently. I haven't liked because I thought they were just they put too much into them. I like the basketball shorts to be really basic. I felt like some of the crazy patterns. I didn't like those that come out in the Easy Money shorts. I liked them just base colors. And, you know, being this, you know, is a very strange, you know, color in the purple pride color that Under Armour has. But um, I do like the simplicity of these shorts. Now, going into the performance of these shorts, you know, that can go either way as far as, you know, the overall design. But when I look at design of the shorts, I want something that I can wear as far as, you know, matching stuff together that I can match with these. Now, I don't have a whole lot of purple shirts, and I, don't, I certainly don't match... I don't match the same colors together. If you can see what I'm wearing now, I'm wearing white on black. So essentially what I can do is, you know, if I've got a solid base color such as, um, you know, something very basic such as a gray, a black, or a white, you know, these shorts go really well with it, I think. Now I'm not telling you how to wear these shorts, but, you know, this is the color that I choose. And I've never owned a pair of purple shorts in my life, so that's why I bring that up. They're not too tacky, but the simplicity, you know, makes it to where I can wear them with almost anything. Um, but as far as going into the performance, um, you know, what I like about these, I believe this is, I want to say it's a 10 and a half inch seam, inseam, 10 and a half inseam short, I want to say. Um, but, you know, what I do like about it is, uh, like I said, the simplicity of these. Uh, you know, you've got pockets on both sides, which is a plus in a lot of basketball shorts. You know, most basketball shorts do come with uh, pockets. Um, so the length, you know, is not overly, you know, lengthy to say like the uh, Easy Money shorts. But these um, are very good short that I like. Um, as far as, uh, you know, the fabric, it's, uh, it's a polyester, uh, very, very stretchy. Um, waistband's great. It's it's about two inches thick. Eh, yeah, about maybe one and a half inches thick or so. But um, very very nice on the back. You've got the Under Armour logo, and then basketball, uh, which I do like. Uh, as far as sizing, you know, all the sizing runs true to size. I don't have any issues there. Uh, you know, here in a minute I'll show you what they look like on. But uh, overall, you know, as a basketball short, I think this is the one to go to. I haven't necessarily tried out all of the new basketball shorts that have come out, but this was uh, one that stood out in my mind. Um, it retails for $30. $30. Um, I found it on sale on the Under Armour outlet. If you can still go on there and find it, they had a few colors uh, for about $21. And, I, and that's when I got this color. It was $21, and I thought it was a good buy on it. So, um, other than that, that's really the uh, kind of performance stuff. Um, like I said, I like the design, um, and we're just going to jump in and kind of show you what they look like. All right, so here are the Under Armour Big Time and Basketball Shorts uh, on me. So I'll give you a little 360 spin right here, kind of show you the dimensions of them, kind of what they look like. All right, so, um, you know, it's all heat gear. You know, as far as the fabric goes, it fits really loose. Um, you can tell here's my knees. They just barely cover over my knees as far as height. You guys know my height. I am 6'1", so I uh, do have longer legs. Um, but this this is a good, uh, I think for me, this length is perfect. And it's, uh, I want to say it's a 10 and a half. And if I'm wrong, it may be an 11 or a 12. But I'm pretty certain that it's a 10 and a half inch inseam. Um, they don't feel as long as the, uh, you know, obviously as the easy money shorts, which go down a little bit further. But uh, some people don't like that short because it is too long. Um, it just kind of out proportions your body. But I think, you know, with this short, as far as the sizing, it's all good. 
um, you know, good true size. I like I like just the feel of these. They they feel like uh, it's a short that I can you know use in an everyday scenario, and then also you know if I'm training or you know even playing basketball for that fact. So I'm a basketball coach as well as a football coach, and you know my school colors are purple. So um, as far as basketball goes, so this is why I kind of got them uh, as a purple basketball short because I am a basketball coach as well as football. So. You guys didn't know that, but uh, otherwise, this is a uh, bit my review of the Unarmored Big Time Basketball Short. If you guys have any more questions on these, just be sure to leave me a comment down below, and I'll get back to you. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram uh, for updates, and we will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.